don't get to die. Hi, I'm Jimmy Stewart, the creator of the Vancouver B-Movie Factory, and uh, this is going to be a good episode because this is a chance for me to say thank you to a bunch of people who've really helped us out in the past. Let's go say thanks now. Hey guys, this is going to be a good one. Introduce yourselves. Hi, I'm Raven. I'll be the talent coordinator for this episode, and my favorite TV series is Once Upon a Time. Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm the director for this episode, and my favourite TV series is Game of Thrones. Hi, I'm Ellen. I'm the inspiration for this episode, and my favourite TV series is Law & Order SVU. And I'm Jimmy Stewart, and this is the Vancouver B Movie Factory. So guys, I'm really pleased about this. Introduce yourself and uh, tell them why we're going to be happy about this. I um, am from Britannia Community Services Centre and we're located at 1661 Napier Street right off of Commercial Drive and we service the community of Grandview, Woodland and Strathcona community and we are a community services centre uh, alongside with the Vancouver Parks Board, the Vancouver School Board and the Vancouver Public Library and we provide services for the community, uh, wellness, recreation, uh, fitness and alongside we support arts and culture and artists and this is how we met Jimmy. We've had a great relationship with Britannia for uh, close to almost a year now. Yes. Yeah. yeah and uh, they, they allowed us to come in every Wednesday to have a space for an hour to two hours to come up with our, our films mm -hmm. and we've created some really great great ideas for, in that space and so this is my opportunity to have, show off to the to our audience and show off to you guys that this is such a great great place to be. It is. <laughs> and and what, uh, what they have allowed us to do is use a couple of rooms in the high school to do uh, for our inspiration for this film. So uh, I wonder, does the control room have a way to play back that, uh, that uh, the tape? Let's see. Oh, there you go. <laughs> So yeah. this is going to be our main entrance mm -hmm. for uh, the, the, the how to start the film, probably. Yeah, and one of the rooms is room 111. And yeah, it's our drama music room, which is sort of like a glee sort of atmosphere uh, room. So uh, we have, it's a big space, um, and we can make lots of noise. Uh, can't blow anything up. <laughs> uh, and then our second room is room 109. So it's, it's sort of a meeting, sort of boardroom-ish. Um, we can move around the tables and, and such and uh, figure that out. There's a baby carriage. I don't know what we <laughs> um, and also we're going to have, yeah, using the hallways um, and the locker area. And uh, yeah, it's a there will be no one around, so we'll be able to uh, have the area for ourselves. And uh... wow, that's cool! Awesome space there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that yeah. that should be uh, quite quite uh, a ton of thoughts can be done in that area. So, what do you guys think? What what do you what do you think you'd like to do? I have a thought. We could probably do maybe. Um, Something maybe against bullying in high school. You know, like show how that's not right. You know, support the no bullying in high school. I like that's that. big, right? Yeah. We could maybe create some sort of story around that idea. If you have any ideas to add to that. Uh, yeah. So we would have to decide, like, what are they getting bullied about? Who's getting bullied? And what do they do about it? So beginning, middle, and end. I'd like it to end it in a positive note. You know, I like it to start off where it's really troublesome and then it ends off happy. Like you know? a person, like, like maybe they standing up for themselves. Right, they stand up for yeah. themselves and then, you know, have some self-esteem and then be like, yeah, see, you know, something like that maybe. Mm -hmm. What happens like, between after class, lunch, and then why it's awesome in the hallway. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. 
I was thinking maybe in the class, in the uh, lunchroom one, have like the victim sitting by themselves. I don't know. <laughs> or we could end in the lunchroom even with uh, the one that says "Don't bully," and then they sit down and eat lunch with them even. Yeah. You know, sure, sure. we we could yeah, be bullying I in the hallway that. even and end in the lunchroom, mm -hmm. so we don't have to just totally end in the hallway. Yeah, it could well, be just any an way, idea. you guys. One, yeah. You know, if you right. want to start in the class, go in the hallway into the lunchroom. Mm. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so we'll start off in the class classroom atmosphere. The, the new kid comes in late, um, and they sit down, and uh, the teacher's talking, and they have to partner up, let's say, and, and the new kid gets partnered up with the bully. And then from there, um, conversations go on. I don't know if he bullies him because of what he's wearing or she or, or whatever it is, but um, then we grow on that. And from that escalation, then the bell rings and we make our way through the hallway. Yep. Um, and then in the hallway, we can have the bullies' mates all joining in with the bullying, like blocking them or dropping the victim's books um, or, or shoving him yeah, taunting, against the locker. Or, yeah. Or, yeah. And maybe there's some other child in the corner watching that happen in the hallway, so they move off to the lunchroom. And then that one person's nice to the new person. Joins. Shows, shows uh, he's friendly and nice, and no bullying. Maybe you could run yeah. something from that. <laughs> At positive ending in the lunchroom. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So that seems like a pretty solid idea. What do you guys think? I like it. I like it. Yeah, yeah. we can Definitely. use this build from. Should we take that back to the group? Let's yeah, do it. Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. Excellent. Excellent. Cool. Stay tuned. It's finally here, the show that you've been waiting for. The Vancouver Bee Movie Factory, where movie making dreams come true. Check your local listings for air times. All right, um, as you know, we usually meet up together to discuss what we're gonna do, but this one is a top secret meeting location. At the Britannia Community Service Center, just off a of commercial drive, under the Vancouver Public Library in their Learning Resource Center. I seem to have lost track. I can't see any signs where, where, to, where to go. Hi, I'm Ellen, and I will be the inspiration for this episode. Hi, Hi. 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 Hi, I'm Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Hey, Sarah. And I'm the director for this episode. <laughs> hey, guys. I'm Raven, and I'm going to be film coordinator. Hey, Hi. Raven. <laughs> So we have three rooms that we'll be using at the um, Britannia Secondary High School. We will be using room 109, which is a typical high school room, uh, um, <coughs> classroom. And also the uh, another room, room 111, which is the music drama room. And then the hallway corridor. Um, the room uh, 109, which is the classroom, will have a new student come in and they are brand new to the school and they're late uh, while the teacher is performing the class and they sit down, um, loans to behold perhaps um, to someone who will be bullying them soon. Uh, we can transpire into, they have to be partnered up and the new kid will be partnered with the bully. And then we dissolve into the hallway. And it transitions from just the one bully to the bully's mates joining in. Um, we're going to have them in the hallway, like blocking the kid or pushing them into the locker, something like that. Um, dropping the kids' books on the floor, and then we go to the lunchroom. And where maybe in the lunchroom, this one child that was watching all that happen from the hallway decided to go in and be nice, so it's a positive outcome. Where he was getting bullied, then someone decided to be nice and show some. Love and care and yeah, anti bullying. That's the idea. Any other ideas? Just from anybody? That's what we came up with last night. What do you guys think? I like it's it. It's great. It's great idea. Yeah, yeah. shoot. Good location. And now it's time to get the gang split up into two groups. Let's have the actors, the writers, the director together. 
And on the other side, we'll have the cinematographer with his crew. Hey, Jess, come here. Yes. Uh, a wide shot of the classroom. Like, nobody wants to be a partner to the Foley, and that's why even though the student comes in late, he doesn't have a partner. Yeah, so, so, everyone else. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, she's at her locker, she shuts it, and she's on her phone checking her messages, and she gets a bad message from somebody from Facebook. And then she that's when she feels terribly alone because physically and mentally no one's paying any attention to her. At this point, I catch the crew watching a film. They say it's for inspiration, but <laughs> yeah, inspiration. Now is the time for the gang to all get together and summarize their plans. To stage, janitor is dated, and then room where um, there will be the new student entering in with the uh, principal, introducing them to the class. The teacher will be teaching Canadian history. She goes into the lunchroom, gets her food. She goes to sit down where all the bullies are. They move away and leave her. She goes to sit next to another people. They go away and leave her. She sits there all by herself, and then one of the good friends sits beside her and then they go hey and it ends and that's the next yeah. Sorry, I didn't know. Oh, wonderful, you did great. Sorry. Just now we're all on the same page. Awesome, so what do you guys think? Yeah. Oh, it's great. Yeah. Woo. Woo. <laughs> it's finally here. The show that you've been waiting for. The Vancouver B Movie Factory, where movie making dreams come true. Check your local listings for airtimes. It's shoot day! We're all getting here at the Britannia Secondary School bright and early and signing in. The crew is all excited, but we seem to be missing a few people. We have so much to do today, we have to get started. Hopefully, they're just running a little bit late. All right, technical rehearsal and action on rehearsal. What happened to the principal? She's just gone. <laughs> got sent to the office. <laughs> <laughs> Very naughty. So my actors ready? Yep. Ready. And action. Alan, I brought you a new student. Would you like to introduce yourself? I'm Taylor Jameson, but I just moved in town. Okay, Taylor, welcome. I'm sure you'll fit right in. Taylor, if you could have a seat right next to Courtney, please. Okay, and cut. Okay, we're about three hours in, and uh, the reason I haven't talked to you guys earlier is because, well, flu season has taken a whole bunch of people out. We've lost a couple actors, we've lost our DOP, and we've lost our director. We're gonna get through this. Continue watching. Okay. You can't. But dear the hello. You have that old. And action. You better be good at history, freak, because you're gonna be doing all the work. Better be good at history, freak, because you're gonna be the only one doing the work. <laughs> you're so mean to me. <laughs> okay, guys, um, we're gonna shoot this, okay? Everyone stand by, please. Quiet on set. Okay. First position. See one eye, you take one. And action. Better be good at history, freak, because you're going to be doing all the work. Okay. Right. Another one? Action. One last take, and we'll have all the angles. Because you're going to be doing all the work. All right. It's time for a well-deserved break and have some pizza. You guys walk up to the camera like this. Okay. 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 Okay.
Yummy. Yummy. You want to bite too bad? <laughs> <laughs> Don't give us. <laughs> Okay, we're working hard, having a little break, but we're behind schedule still, so we have to pick it up. Keep watching. That's good. We'll take that. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. Yay. We are way behind schedule. Everyone, listen to this. We are way behind schedule. There was another scene, uh, a scene in here with the cell phone. We're going to have to cut that. We're going to have to cut the cell phone bit because we are way behind schedule. So we're going to move into the lunchroom now. Okay, so it's uh, five hours in and uh, we're doing a ton of work. We're getting there. We're still a little bit behind, but uh, Oh, I hope we can do this. It's looking good. Let's watch. Even though we lost a lot of people to the flu, we got it done. And now all you have to do is to wash our stuff! Woo! It's finally here. The show that you've been waiting for. The Vancouver Bee Movie Factory, where movie making dreams come true. Check your local listings for airtimes. Welcome back. Hey guys. Hi. Did you have fun? Hey. Yes. Oh, fantastic. Um, yeah. I wasn't actually there. I was sick. What? Oh, you yeah. weren't there? No. I, I was directing was from offset. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think from the, your bed. The, yeah. the, the director channeled you, I think. That we got all the things mm -hmm. that you wanted done, I think. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes, we did. And how, what did you think of the day? I loved it. It was great. The kids had great energy. Um, you know, there was food. <laughs> it always helps, right? Yeah. And yeah, I thought it went well. And the location, what did you Location think was wonderful. Yeah. Actually, real high school, it's authentic, you know. It's really great. And thank you for allowing us to go yeah, and, and create this short film there. Thank it's you, Britannia. Britannia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, well, Britannia. That's a good, good point. How do the people at home get in touch with you? They can go to our website at BritanniaCenter.org and visit our website and see all the great things that we do and what we offer. Absolutely. 
Cool. Very nice. So, um, before we get started to watch the film, which I think everybody's really ready yeah, to go, yeah. <laughs> why don't we invite your kids in and they can watch it with us? Oh, that would be great. Hey guys, come over. They were a big part mm -hmm. in the film, so I think they, they should have yeah. a chance to watch it. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, how about the control room? You guys ready in the uh, control room? Ready in the control room. Woo! Excellent. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah. Roll it. Remember to keep your provincial presentations to under three minutes. Good afternoon, class. Ms. Stratlin, I've brought you a new student. Would you like to introduce yourself? Uh, hi, I'm Taylor Jameson. I just moved into town. Okay, Taylor, welcome. I'm sure you'll fit right in. Taylor, if you could have a seat next to Courtney, that would be great. We just paired up for the assignment. I'll debrief you right after class. Welcome. All right, guys, remember, not like last time, equal opportunity, there's two of you. That means both partners speak, both partners Better be good at history, freak, because you're gonna be doing all the work. That's eight hours, guys. Yeah, wow, wow. That was really great. <laughs> in what, five, three minutes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, crazy, yeah. yeah, no, it was good. Wow. That was really good. Good editing. Yeah. I love, yep. are we on? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I love the, the slow motion of that. that. Was, really kind of sent chills up my spine. And yeah. Felt it. It was great. <laughs> it's too bad we couldn't get everything that we wanted. But I did really want to do that cell phone part <clears throat> where the cell phone bullying and, yeah. the, and internet bullying, but just the time just didn't uh, allow it to happen. We still told the story though, yeah. and that's yeah. what matters, right? Short and sweet. And it's good. You know, you had a lot of work with all those people yes. as talent mm -hmm. coordinator, and it you did was. a really good job. Thank you. It was very much fun. I loved it. Yeah. Well, yeah. even though we had all those people that said they were coming, but they all got sick. We yeah. made it. Everybody got sick. It was unbelievable. Yeah. We had um, not uh, not just you getting sick, <laughs> but we had our DOP. We had a couple of people who, act, uh, who were going to be part of the crew that called in sick as well, and we had a couple of actors that were mm -hmm. called in sick. So Some we of the extra teenagers. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. yeah we we had uh, we had not that many pe people to, to uh, get her done, but we did. We pulled it off. Yeah. Yes, we did. Yeah. Well, okay. <laughs> it was great. Yeah. And so um, I want to thank uh, you and Britannia <clears throat> for allowing us to, to come in and play in your location. No, it was our pleasure, and um, we were we did a great job. And the center does a lot of that, where we um, spawn we uh, really. Um, take care of our community and want to sponsor our artists and uh, showcase our community so that's what we want to do. You do a really good job of it. Thank you. Wonderful. <laughs> and I want to thank you guys, all of you, all the B-Movie Factory people in the panel here 
thank you very much for doing the job that you did. I know you got <laughs> sick. <laughs> you were still there. <laughs> but you were a big part of it, even though it, you didn't. You don't feel like you were. Well, it's called invisible. I was there. I was invisible. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I would like to thank all the Vancouver B Movie Factory people who did show up, and uh, and all the people who were sick. I'm sorry, but I still want to thank you guys. <laughs> all the Vancouver B Movie Factory members. They keep coming out every week, and we keep coming out with more more movies. That's why we're called a factory, guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so thank you. And um, hey, we had a great night tonight, and thanks for watching. So good night. Good night. Good night, guys. Good night. Good night. <laughs> no, we can still talk, though. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Freeze. <laughs> That's good. I like it.